Recently, Forbes, which is a financial services reporting firm, published an article online talking about what the highest earning college graduates students studied. I wanted to take that report and access the data it provided and show the earnings potential of medical laboratory scientists. So I'll take a minute just to show you the slides that highlight the data from the U.S. Department of Education in their college scorecard. And this is from December 2020. And you'll notice for medical laboratory scientists, also known as clinical laboratory scientists. Here is a summary of the article. We saw this from the webpage itself. It was written by Preston Cooper from Forbes in December of 2020. So this presentation slide talks about two-year. What did high-earning two-year college graduates study? This was two years after they completed their degree. And I'm going to focus on nursing and other health professions because other health professions includes medical laboratory science, even the two-year degree version of medical laboratory technology. And you can see there are certainly some presence for the lower income ranges, the less than 25,000 per year and then 25 to 40,000. But look where nursing and allied health dominate in terms of the higher income opportunities um, in that 40,000 plus range. Let's go to the next slide and let's look at college graduates with a bachelor's degree. And really what I want to focus on here is biology. And you can see in the two lower, earn, lower earning income columns, less than 30,000 and 30 to 45,000, that biology in the first one occupies a prominent position, less so in the 30 to 45,000 range, but really you don't see it at all represented in the 45,000 plus range. But what you do see, again, is a dominant position for nursing and other health professions, of which the medical laboratory is part. All across the board, with increasing numbers, from early in the career, probably to later in the career, significant income earning opportunity. Let's take a quick look then at some examples. Marquette University, for a clinical or medical laboratory scientist, $58,000 per year. Albany, it's the College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences up in New York, 63,000. Baptist Memorial in Tennessee, at 63,000 also. Eastern Michigan at 57,000 and change. Nice solid number of graduates there. That's a big program at 23. And then the last thing I wanna point out is, is a reminder. And one of the reasons we do these informational sessions is to encourage those looking at this video with a Bachelor of Science in Biology, or close to that degree, or even Chemistry, to consider a career in medical laboratory science. There is a demand, there is a need, and there is a career opportunity. For those interested, please contact us at gary, G-A-R-Y, at mls2030.com. We'll look forward to hearing from you.